And Memorial Day may be tomorrow, but today three local veterans were honored in a big way. These veterans all over the ages of 99 got to throw first pitch baseballs at today's Trash Pandas game. Our Nixon Norman was there and has more on this story. Three local senior veterans were given the opportunity to throw a first pitch the day before Memorial Day, a day to honor those who have sacrificed so much for this country. Great grandson and former UAH baseball player says what an honor throwing a first pitch is. Oh, I think it's an awesome honor. You know, it recognizes somebody and for whatever they do. And, you know, Pop Pop, great example of that. He's a great veteran. He's a great hero. And, you know, all the veterans that threw out the first pitch, you had 5,000 people on their feet standing and cheering. This mass reaction was shocking to the veterans. Oh, it's, it's unbelievable that the uh, response of the people, you know, how much the people care and everything. But the love is very much reciprocated. People, I love people. See them all smiling faces. It's great, I love them. One of these veterans is very familiar with the game of baseball. In fact, he used to play among some of the greats. Jackie Robinson, Campanella, and uh, Luke Easter. Now he's made it back to the field once again. You know what, when you get 99 years old, and still able to walk and move for yourself. That's a blessing in itself. And then here I am over here throwing out the first pitch. Wonderful. Wonderful. And Hill is glad to be out in the thick of it all. When you're 103 and a half, you don't see much excitement. But uh, it's been a wonderful day. I have really enjoyed being here. Wooten's great grandson mentions how none of this would be possible without the sacrifices that these and other veterans have made. You know, baseball is America's pastime, but we wouldn't be able to come to baseball games or do anything like that without these these great veterans. And I'll tell you the truth, it's, it's great to be seen. Putting the Valley first, Nixon Norman, WZDX News.